Children from the Stonebridge and Tockington areas have been given the opportunity to improve their reading skills with the help of coaches from QPR. The kick into reading after school club has been introduced at the Tockington Library and the project has been designed to encourage children aged between 7 and 11 to discover the joys of reading. Coaches from QPR will be given their time to work with the group to develop reading, speaking and listening skills and I caught up with community coach Dean Christopher to learn more about the project. Uh, the scheme is to get children, use their, just use their local libraries. We uh, let them know all the facilities in there. Besides the books, there's use of the internet. Uh, it's also got a lot, they've got TVs and stuff. They can rent videos and DVDs out, so there's a lot more ways of learning now. You can learn a lot more stuff off the internet. And it's just letting them know about QPR, we're doing it. Letting them have some fun and that. And just bonding, really getting out. And it does seem that you're using football as a tool to teach them. It seems quite popular. Yeah, well, a lot of the uh, a lot of the children, they obviously like football so popular nowadays and that. So if you introduce football into it, it attracts more kids in the library if they know someone from QPR is coming. So I know they uh, get to ask us questions about our jobs and what we do and stuff as well. So how exactly have you been involved and how have QPR been involved in helping the scheme to take off in the way it has? About three years ago, we get people come in and they give us a training on what games, riddles and stuff to do for the kids, give us stories to give to them, tell them all what, what books are good in that through the football. And we basically get training and we get sort of get sent out. A bit nerve-wracking at first, but once you get used to it, it's all right. And that, it makes a change from the football. But it's, uh, I mean, it's, it's good to get out in that and uh, just beating the kids, really. Has it been well received by the youngsters? I've never seen a, a group of young lads and girls so enthusiastic about reading and being taught. Yeah, no, no, it's good. If you go to certain places and sometimes you go there, you might only get a few kids to start. But if you make them have fun and that and they enjoy it, you find the numbers growing. I mean, sometimes we start off at Holden Library with four and five kids and got up to 14, 15 kids. And, I mean, other places, it seems a lot of schools we've gone into, we've gone into a school said, can you come off for a one-on session? And the kids have really enjoyed it. And I've worked at a few schools where they said, can you come back and give us a six-week course? So, yeah, it's been very popular in the schools as well as the libraries. So is the key to it being a success, the fact that the kids do enjoy it, is that the main thing, that you make sure they do enjoy it and have fun? Yeah, I mean, the, the, we do have a blend. We have an activity, we tell them stories, fun stories and that. We talk about football, uh, we talk about what we do, like out coaching kids, football at schools and that. And we try and teach a bit about the club and the library. And yeah, if you, if you make them have fun and that, you'll find them come back. We don't just sort of stand about and read a book for an hour. We, we read bits of the books and we tell them what things are about and that, really. So uh, the kick into a reading scheme has proved quite popular over the last two years since its inception. Is it growing now throughout the borough of Brent and beyond? Yeah, I mean, we found out first, when I first done it, I was just in Harlesden Library, then uh, went to a couple of schools in Harlesden and done it and done courses there. They told other schools about it and I ended up going to Stonebridge Park... I'm here today at Wembley. Uh, I've got another new school to go to tomorrow. So it has, yeah, I mean, I, I used to do maybe two hours a month when it started, but at, at the moment I'm probably doing about two or three hours a week. And it is popular, yeah, the kids the kids find find it fun and that, and they bring their mates. And you do have to sometimes, you have to find new games and invent stuff yourself because you get so much so much stuff to do in that. But after a while, if you, you can't keep repeating it, so you find yourself going home, and I find myself making up games for the kids to play in that. And if parents or kids want you to learn more about kicking to reading, how can they do that? Just check all your local libraries. And, I mean, if you tell the staff there, I'm sure the staff will contact us, and like themselves in that, we can set up sessions. Because I know we do stuff, we do a lot of stuff in Brent, but we want to obviously do all areas in that, because it has been popular.